Hey guys, Ty here, and in this video, we are going over troubleshooting your Oculus Link. I've seen a lot of people running into small problems. It can be super frustrating if you don't know how to get around them. I think we've found ways to pretty much quickly solve any technical issues that you may have, make your PC VR experience using your Quest as painless as possible. Uh, it won't be a long video. There's only a few problems to address, really, that I'm aware of or that I've seen. So yeah, let's jump into it. Psycho Tech, Tech Reviews and Tutorials. Okay, so first thing, most important thing, so important, you gotta make sure that you've got a good USB cable, a high quality USB 3 cable. I will provide a link to the cable that I'm using. It works flawlessly. I know quite a few people over in our Facebook group are using this cable. I've also got a couple of extension cables that I've tested, uh, a 30 foot active cable and a 15 foot passive cable that both work very, very well. Speaking of cables, I've seen a lot of reports of people using a USB 3 cable and they are getting video, but they're not getting audio. It turns out it's the cable. So not all USB 3 cables are created equally. They swap out use a new cable and bada bing bada boom they now have audio if you plug your quest into your pc and you're just getting the loading dots after you accept enable oculus link prop comes up you click enable and dot 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 it's just loading and loading and loading just restart the headset. I've had that happen a few times to me and every single time, boom, it's a quick fix. Um, always, and I'll show you here, always check the uh, devices. So open your Oculus software on your PC, come over here and just make sure that you've got grain across the board too. So just that, that'll that eliminate, you know, maybe having a cable problem right there. Something's not plugged in all the way. The cable isn't up to snuff. Make sure that you're getting grain over here uh, like that. Now. I've seen, it's happened to me a couple times where I plug it in, I hear the beep, the cables, you know, the computers recognize it, but I don't get that prompt, enable Oculus Link in the headset. I'll come over to the head, the PC software and I'm like, okay, I got green across the board. Well, I will show you here, you can actually launch the software from within the headset if you don't get that prompt. You're just gonna head over to settings, uh, right here, I've already got this open, so go over to settings, device, scroll all the way to the bottom and you will see enable oculus link click that right there and you're going to notice that boom here we are we are now in our home environment uh, so now you are in the environment and you want to get back out of the pc home environment to your quest home environment there are dose ways to do this you can click on settings and it's just going to pop up first thing disable oculus link beta Boom, you can disable it and that will bring you back to your home, but even quicker and easier, four quick taps on your right home controller will bring you up to here and it's just like backing out of any other game and then you can click quit. Now, if you wanna then get back into Oculus Link, you're gonna try to click enable Oculus Link here and we'll get an error try to click it again, and it's gonna probably say can't find PC. Hey, it worked. The one error that I get fairly consistently though is when I try to back in, it will say can't find the PC. Just unplug the cable for a second, five or six seconds, plug it back in, wait another four or five seconds, and then you'll either get the prompt pop up or you can just click in the settings, enable Oculus link, and that'll work right there. So I think those are just the main problems. Audio, the dot thing forever, and maybe not getting that prompt and then being able to actually launch Link from within the headset without the prompt. Um, those are the main issues that I've seen. If you have any other problems, let me know down in the comments below what they are. I'll see if I can't recreate them and maybe figure out a way to quickly fix those. Uh, or if you've got a problem and a great solution to it, let us know down in the comments. Hit the like button if this video helped you at all. Uh, be sure to hit the subscribe button if you aren't already. Hit the bell button to get notified when I do these videos. And I think that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks.